Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to add comment section to Google Sites. The first thing you will need to do once on sites.google.com, you are going to select the Google site that you would like to add comment section to. After you have selected the site that you would like to add comment section to, I want you to open a second tab and you are going to go on to discuss.com. Discuss.com is a platform that you can use to create comment sections on your website and you can get started for completely free as you can see right here with their basic plan you could sign up and it costs nothing and you don't need a credit card or anything like that to get started. So all you'll need to do is tap on get started in the top right hand corner. From there you can enter your email address and create a password or you can sign up with your Twitter or Facebook account. Once you have signed up and you have verified your account, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. And from here, you can see I want to comment on sites or I want to install Discuss on my site. You're going to tap on I want to install Discuss on my site. Then you're going to simply paste the site URL right here enter the name of your site so we are going to go back into Google Sites and you are going to tap on the link right here then you are going to copy the link once you have copied the link or if you would like to add it to your home page or if you would like to create a brand new page to add it to you can do that so let's say for example I would like to add it to my home page all I would need to do is simply tap right here then copy the link and I'm going to go back into Discuss and I'm going to paste the link right here, enter the name of your website. Once I've entered the name, I'm going to simply clear this section, which is the home section right there. Then you can see select a category. You can select the category that your website is in. So I'm going to leave it as entertainment. Then I'm going to tap on create site. Once you have tapped on create site, you will see the different options right here. And all I want you to do is simply scroll down and you will see basic. We are going to tap on subscribe now. At the you can see the different platforms that you can add it to as you can see right here. All we'll need to do is simply scroll down since we don't see Google sites. We're going to scroll down and we're going to tap right here as we need the manual universal code. So we're going to tap right there. After you have done that, you're going to scroll down and you can see the universal code right here. Please place this code where you'd like Discuss to load. And we're going to tap on Copy. Once you have tapped on Copy, what you'll need to do next is you're going to go back into Google Sites or before even doing that, you can do some form of customization if you want. So for example, you could go over to the left hand menu option and from there you could tap right where you see configure discuss. After you have tapped on configure discuss, if you would like to, for example, change the appearance, you can do that. As you can see the color scheme right here, you could change it from light to dark. You can also change the font style if you want. So you could do all of that if you want. And you can also set up moderation if you want also by tapping on moderation right there. But we are going to use the basic setup. So I'm going to go back right here. Then all you'll need to do now on the section that you would like to add your comment section, you're going to go over to the left hand menu option, tap on embed, then select embed code. And you're going to paste the code and you're going to tap on next. Once you have tapped on next, you're going to give it a few seconds to load up. Once it has loaded up, you could tap on insert and the discuss. After tapping on insert, the discuss comment section will now be added as you can see right here. And you can adjust the comment section by simply pulling on the box as you can see here. So by simply adjusting the box, you can adjust how it looks. So let's see how it looks once it loads up. You can see how it looks right here. 
And once someone wants to comment, they could simply tap on be the first to comment and they could start their discussion. And I'm going to publish it so that we can see how it looks live. So I'll tap on publish in the top right hand corner. Once it is published, you can see how it looks right here. So this is the comment section and that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful. And by the way, you can go back into Discuss. So if we should go back right here, once you have finished setting it up, you can also go back right here. And once you're back in Discuss, you're going to tap right where you see Analytics at the top. You could tap on Analytics and you can see your site comment activity. And you can also monitor and answer comments if you want. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and thank you for watching.